Welcome to AEL Technology and thank you for buying this tutorial of Mastercam X9 2D milling. My name is Sumit and I will be tutor for Mastercam. We are in chapter 1. Chapter 1 deals about introduction of Mastercam. Mastercam is a CAM software that is created by a company called CNC Software in the year 1983. It has successfully completed 33 years. No wonder Mastercam is the leading software in CAM industry now. As per the CNC Cookbook 2015 survey, Mastercam is having 27% of the global market share in CAM industry because it's such a simple and beautiful software and it's very easy to use. Now Mastercam is commonly used in mold making industry, automotive, aerospace and consumer electronics industries. The latest version that is released is Mastercam X9. If you open Mastercam, you can get this UI user interface. You will see menu bars here on the top of the screen. And these are the toolbars. These are the side toolbars here. We got MRU toolbar. That means most recently used menus will be uh, coming in this toolbar we got auto cursor here and general selection bars and we got ribbon bar here and this is toolpath manager this is the graphic window and this is the status bar the first and foremost thing that you need to do when you open master cam is to do the setting of choose either inch or metric here I'll be dealing with metric so we will choose metric uh, startup to do the se uh, settings go to the settings which is in the menu bar here and then click on configuration go to current and select metric as startup and apply it once you apply you can see that on the right bottom end of the graphic window uh, metric will be appearing if you choose English you can see that inch will be appearing here and next we will see some of the mouse controls if you want to rotate the body a solid body or a geometry you just need to hold the middle button and move your mouse and if you want to zoom in and out you scroll the middle button and if you want to pan the image you click on shift and press the middle button and move the mouse and if you want to rotate a screen at a particular center point press control and middle button and move the mouse and if you want to zoom a particular window you press F1 the function key F1 and select the window and if you want to see the coordinate axis you need to press F9 there are lot of shortcut keys in Mastercam I have given few of it the most commonly uh, used shortcut keys I'll be explaining you these are the 10 most used shortcut keys the first one is alt H and it when you press alt H you will get it goes to mastercam help when you click alt and E you you can just select the geometry or a part that you need to keep it on the screen rest everything will be hidden when you want to refresh the screen you can press function key F3 and when you want to analyze any particular geometry or curve or line you can press function key F4 and if you're working on toolpath and if you want to toggle the toggle display of the toolpath you can use Alt T and 
when you press F9 you can you will be able to see the coordinate axis in dark brown color and it, when you press Alt Z it will take you to the level manager and when you press Alt C it will take you uh, you can it will take you to C hooks and you can select any of the application sub application that you need to run and if you want to toggle between shade you can press Alt S and if you want to uh, the design to fit into the screen you can press Alt F1 and these are the few of the menus in status bar and when you click 3D you have option of getting 2D plane and 3D plane and when you click uh, G view WCS and planes it will take you the top front all the uh, principal views and if you want to work on particular Z level you can enter the value and then whatever you are drawing now will be on Z level on that particular Z level and this is color setup for face solids and surfaces and here we can enter the level and these are the attributes and groups now I will show you all these things in Mastercam.